Sarah Green finds love with late husband Mike Smith's pal and admits it's a strange situation. Sarah Green has found love with racing car driver Rob Gravitt, a good friend of her husband who died in 2014. Rob was pals with Sarah's late husband Mike Smith, who passed away from complications of heart failure after undergoing major heart surgery. The pair ran the Trackstar team that won the 1990 British Touring Car Championship. Eight years on from Mike's passing, Sarah, 64, has revealed that she's now romantically involved with Rob, adding that her late husband of 25 years played a part in their meeting. She explained on the My Time Capsule podcast, I sort of know Mike is pulling so many strings in my life. She continued, He has undoubtedly been responsible for me meeting my beloved, who was one of his oldest friends who waited a certain amount of time but did keep leaving messages on the answering machine. I thought he was just being kind. Then I got a message almost saying, for God's sake, Greeno, Rob is trying to make contact with you because he actually wants to take you out, not because he's kind. So will you just get off your ass and go and answer the phone next time it rings? And lo and behold, a whole new conversation started. I'm sure, and Rob is very sure too, because it's a very strange situation. The TV presenter went on to address what it was like for Rob coming into her home and seeing pictures of Mike everywhere, but her new beau was insistent that it wasn't uncomfortable for him. I remember being terribly worried and saying to this dear man who I'd known for all these years, isn't it strange coming into the house and seeing all these pictures everywhere of Mike? Sarah recalled. Rob, said, no, no, it's not strange. It'd be strange if they weren't there. And remember, I love him too. In the wake of Mike's death, Sarah took on his company Flying TV which provides aerial television footage. Speaking about taking over the company, Sarah said, there was no doubt that's what, Mike, would have wanted me to do. She went on, there'd be mornings I'd wake up almost with a tap on the shoulder saying, right, have you checked the, it was very strange but wonderful, as well as having a keen interest in race car driving. Mike was known for presenting the radio breakfast show and Top of the Pops. He also hosted BBC's Live Aid broadcast in 1985.